Hey guys, today I will be showing you how I retwist my hair to maintain my hair growth in fullness. I will be using three products in this video, rose water, argan oil, and this nature's blessing grease. I really think that's the best technique to grow in here fast and full by minimizing the amount of manipulation you have to do to your locks, amount of work you're doing, and amount of products you're using. So to start, I just make sure that I spray my hair. My hair isn't wet already. I'm just spraying my hair with some rose water, and I will be using some regular water as well. And then I'm going to make sure that I grease my scalp and moisturize my locks from the root down. Using the oil, I'm not going to be using grease oil down my lock because I'm a bit concerned that it does cause more length than I need, but I'm not sure. And that is how I will proceed to do my hair throughout this whole video. I know that when I started my locks, they were extremely thin and I did not think that they would thicken up as thick as they have gotten. But I'm so proud of them and I'm so proud of myself because over the eight years that I've had locks, I've only been to the salon to actually do them, I believe, four times. So I knew that once I started, I would be maintaining my locks myself. And for me, that means doing the most easiest thing I possibly can. I did not start my locks by myself. I went to a hairdresser and she started them for me. I showed her a picture of how full I wanted them, how thick I wanted them to be, and she parted them out on her own. I didn't make any suggestions and I'm really proud how they turned out. Some things now I think I would have changed, but I'm no professional. So I'm definitely okay with how my locks are and I do not ever see me taking them out to change anything. Aside from that, I do not bleach my hair and I do not color my hair. One time I bleached them, that's why you see a few highlights and blonde trends. I bleached like nine of them and then I instantly ended up coloring them back brown. So I'm not someone who likes to bleach my hair or color it. So this is just how they are. And the front of my hair is where my hair is thinnest. So those are my thinnest locks. And honestly, they're always breaking. And I'm like, as they've gotten longer, they usually break at the ends. And it just makes me so sad. But it is what it is. I make sure not to keep that dead weight on. And I wait for them to fall off or I just cut them off. So aside from that, this retwist lasts me at least six weeks. And that's when I'll probably be washing my hair again. And um, it doesn't stay so slick and smooth like this, but I'm really not into having it so slick. I don't even use a comb. I just feel my way around and I retwist my hair accordingly. So yeah, enjoy this video and watch me retwist from back to front. If you have any questions, be sure to leave them in, in the comment section below. And thank you all for watching.